and welcome to Hollywood, New England. I'm Gail Scott Key. And I'm John Campanello. Welcome to the show. Well, Gail, today's show we have a special guest. Yes. Uh, as you know, we've been interviewing a lot of actors and producers and filmmakers. And today we have an, a young actor by the name of William Erickson with us today. William, welcome to the show. Thank you. Hi, William. Hi. Now you the, like Willie, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's okay. Well, yeah. Willie. Now, really cool with that. now the, the cool <laughs> thing about having Willie here is that he is... Uh, a SAG after actor, yeah. uh, has been acting since he was five years old, and uh, in, in, it brings a different dimension to it because you're, you're under 18, so, so there are different kind of um, requirements and experiences that under 18 has these rules and things mm -hmm. like that for, for how, um, you know, work, hours on set, et cetera. So, so those are those interesting to find out. But fast forward now, you're 15 and a half. Yeah. You've done commercials for Oakhurst Dairy, Days Jewelers, P the Portland Pirates. We saw you on a national commercial for Subway where you got Coke splattered all over you. <laughs> uh, you've done a number of independent films. You've been in uh, The Box with Cameron Diaz. You've been in Mall Cop with, um, um, what's his name? Kevin James. Ke thank you, Kevin James. That was a test. Um, you had a Love small Kevin role James. in The Surrogates. So you, you've, you've really kind of come into your own. And, but you've also done a lot of theater as well. So, so which, which do you prefer? Do you prefer theater or do you prefer the on camera? Do you prefer commercials? Do you prefer film? What, what, I what definitely is it for you? prefer being on camera because theater, theater, like, don't get me wrong, is a lot of fun. But, like, film has just been an interest of mine mm -hmm. since um, I pretty much started it. And, like, I did, I was Tiny Tim at the Palace Theater. Mm -hmm. um, and that was, that was a lot of fun, but, like, I just take more interest in film because I don't know. I like me and my me and my family like, like used to make these home videos and edit them. My brother learned how to edit edit like um, little films that we did, and I just took an interest in more film than theater. Great. Okay. Well, you know, it's interesting. Also, with the resume that you have, you've been able to travel. It's allowed you to travel. What What are some of the places that you've gone to, and what is your favorite that you've gone to? Um, I would have to say, well, I was on a reality TV show called Fetch with Ruff Ruffman. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I would say, um, we went to Florida for a challenge. It's about, um, it's a game show with this animated dog who gives us challenges. And he gave me and this other girl who was on the show a challenge to go to Florida mm -hmm. and ride all these roller coasters. And I gotta say, that was, that was an experience. Like, yeah, because you was, like roller coasters? Yeah. Oh, I get scared. Oh. <laughs> the whole show was a great experience. <laughs> That's and, great. Um, we, we got the whole like park to ourselves, basically. So we got to ride really? the roller coasters over and over because they have to take more than one take. Oh, for. That's, That's right. awesome. Yeah, as far That's as awesome. I know, only Michael <laughs> Jackson gets a whole park. Yeah, <laughs> That's what I thought. Wow. Well, we're hanging out with you more often. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, that was a lot of fun, and um, we then I got to swim with dolphins. That was in Florida. Oh, that was wow. probably that has one of got my to be incredible. And all part wow. of the same show. All part of Fetch with Ruff Ruffman. Yeah. Okay. And how did you how did you land a role on that show? What was that process? Um, well, I've kn I've known Mora, who actually casted for Fetch. Okay. I've known her since. I gotta say, I, since I was five, when I was too scared to go into that mm -hmm. first audition. Um, so, and, but then she quickly found out that I, w I was like wanting to be an actor, and my mom wasn't actually pushing me. She never pushed me. <laughs> yeah, I know. I want to make that clear again. We'd have a disclaimer okay. for his yeah, mom. We'll make that clear again. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. She's definitely not a stage mom. So Mora, she she's known me and. Um, I think I did a really great audition. There were five callbacks, so wow. it was pretty. It was pretty nerve-wracking. It was probably two or three days after the last audition that I got that call that I was one of the six kids who was going to be on the pitch with Ralph Ruffman. And my dad ended up telling me after he said, "Casey, you're a great tennis player," and he said, "Willie, congratulations," and I just started screaming. <laughs> <laughs> it was just such a that was that was an awesome moment. And, and how how many episodes were you on that show for? Was uh, I was on twenty episodes, fifteen wow. challenges, and the other five were like, we had to be in the studio answering questions on the other kids' challenges because mm -hmm. it's a game show and you get points and mm -hmm. stuff. Okay. Um, speaking of the business, you uh, 
being a younger actor, um, this is not only a great thing for you, but your, your parents are, are very heavily involved. And, and I'm wondering uh, what, what, what that's like to be spending so much time with your parents, because when you go on a set, you have to go with a parent. Yeah. When you go on auditions, you have to go with a parent. You know, they have to be involved in all the business aspects. Uh, what's, 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 like, what's it like hanging out with mom or dad <laughs> so much on a set? When you're an extra, you're there for 10 hours or yeah. 8 hours. They're there with you. So, so what's the, it's almost like a business arrangement you have with your own parents. What's that like? Yeah, well, my mom has been pretty much managing me. Um, I would say she's like pretty much my agent manager. Um, because she's always on the computer looking for like auditions and when we're all on set um, I would get to know the other extras um, And just hang out with them like I wouldn't hang out with my mom the whole time <laughs> not that not that that's a bad thing <laughs> <laughs> but um, basically she's pretty much Doing all the business work for me, but she's starting to teach me how to do it on my own because I'm getting my license soon, and I'll be driving uh -oh. myself to auditions. <laughs> and um, she's basically just teaching me everything that she knows. Okay, yeah. That's cool. She seems very sweet. Yeah. We she's love Willie's mom. <laughs> <laughs> I love my mom. I don't know where I'd be without her, actually. That's she's cool. worked so hard for me. And that's been very great. cool. Yeah. So that's a bittersweet relationship to have. Yeah. Wow. Uh, leads me to a question. Uh, you're in school. You, uh, you are chasing auditions and, yeah. and film work, um, and um, you also have to hone your craft a little bit. Mm -hmm. You have to continually train. How do you balance everything? And if you have to make a choice, you know, because you just don't have enough hours in a day, what's, what's the choice? Where, where is your ultimate focus? Um, my ultimate focus is, my priority is probably acting, mm -hmm. but I also need my education and I want to go to college for a backup because there's always that it's chance smart. that I might smart. not make it. Yeah. Um, and I already kind of have a backup plan. I want to go, I don't know what college I want to get into, but it's probably going to be somewhere in California because yeah. okay. I've always wanted to just move out there. Yeah. And um, I want to take some type of either electrical or chemical That's one engineering question on here. Courses. But with the look, was that like a. I noticed like when you when you have some headshots, was this thought about? Because it's very, very cool. Girls, stop licking the TV. <laughs> stop kissing the TV. <laughs> My goodness. That's a very nice shot. Thanks. Wow. Thanks. Was this a one-time shot? Um, well, we had to take like probably 200 shots to get. Yeah. And That's then bad. we pick out a couple of good ones, and that was probably the best one for a headshot. Very um, cool. I really like it. That's very nice. But the the one thing that I, I know about headshots is that you, you, you have to have you have to be able to see personality, you mm -hmm. have to be able to see depth, um, the eyes are important yeah. and, and, and everything has to be crystal clear. Someone has to look at your shot and see a character. And uh, and and uh, film headshots actually are different than what you would submit for a commercial. Uh, when when you're submitting for a commercial, they like to see eyes and a big smile. Uh, but for, for film and drama, it's, it's more the serious look that you got going on here. So uh, because you love doing it. Yeah, because I love doing <laughs> like, it. Like any job. Lamborghini and everything. I'll wash it. <laughs> well, well key, key to your, your, your ambition and your success, again, is, is goes back to your parents and your mom in particular uh -huh. who, manages, who manages you and works with you. And, and it sounds like you've got an excellent relationship with your mom and your parents and they're very supportive and that that is that is a key factor in, in all of this for you yeah yeah definitely um my mom is pretty much um she's pretty much working for me every day and my dad he like su he's very supportive same with all of my siblings my dad's very supportive in a way that he um he all he always says get the education and I don't know. I don't know if I would if I didn't have him telling me that like every day because That's he great. definitely wants me to go to college and have a backup because I don't want to be waiting on tables. Parents are going to be lined up <laughs> outside the Hollywood outside. New England doors waiting for them. <laughs> Listen up. Um, uh, quick, might, we can plug your website if people want to find mm -hmm. out what you're up to. Yep, it's WilliamBErickson.com. WilliamBErickson.com. Uh, we are out of time yeah. already, unfortunately, <laughs> but this was great. It We're really was. So helpful. <laughs> so thankful. Yeah.